Yo, what's good? It's your boy Chaos bringing you guys another video. I'm bringing you guys part two today of the mini scheme that I started out of pistol. Really, really good, uh, really, really good formation no matter what you're doing. But if you really want to mix things up, change it up, it's February, it's, Mar it's March actually now. Um, why not give it a chance? Go to the pistol playbook, check out this formation. It's got other good formations. It's got pistol bunch, it's got pistol trips. It's got a lot of good things in there, man. Check out the book, check out the formation I'm giving you guys. Why not give it a chance? Um, but yeah, if you guys haven't already, make sure to check out the description. I've dropped new ebooks. So on uh, offense, we have a very in-depth trip site and very, very good. It's what I use in weekend league. And my 335 odd and Big Nickel Over G uh, defenses, which is also what I've used in weekend league. I've gone 25 and 0, 24 and 1. Tons of top 10, top 25 finishes and a, and a couple number one overalls this year, man. So you, make sure you guys check that out. And uh, let's jump into the video. Okay, guys. I'll bring you guys part two, like I said, of this Pistol U Deep slot. We're in the Pistol Playbook. As I mentioned in the last video, guys, if you guys haven't seen that, make sure you guys check it out. It'll be in the card right above me um, in the top right corner. Um, it'll have the video from the first one, and then it'll let you go straight into this one. So uh, the last time we did um, Double Post, which is a very, very good play, and then we had PA Boot Over. Um, today is... This play might even be better than the PA boot over, so um, it's the same setup no matter what, whether they're blitzing or not. Um, it's going to be drag the, t the inside tight end, motion the other tight end over on a fade, and then you have the crosser in the post. So if they're in cover two like this, right, with no shading, this is no shading at first, okay? Oh yeah, reblock the running back as well, because um, the PA is very bad on this play. Um, the mid read is going to follow that post. And you can throw that right there. I'll show you guys that one more time. It's usually way more even open than that. Um, I'll show you guys one more time. This is with no shading. So, um, baseline press here. This mid is going to man up on the on the crosser. So you're going to see that. It's not even going to do a good job in man. I'm not I'm not going to throw this post. I'm not throwing the post. I'm not throwing the post. So, I want to show you that. But, I'm going to the replays real quick. I wanted to let it run. So, <clears throat> If they don't shade, this mid-read is going to man up this crosser, but it's going to do an awful job. So you see he mans it up, and he keeps following it. Which, when he mans up like that, like, you guys see how naked this post is. Um, it's literally wide open. So you have that, right? And then, now if they do shading, right? So they shade down, it's not going to man up anymore. So I'm shading down. And if you want to recloud, you can recloud, whatever. But I'm shading down so that it won't man. Same setup here. It's not going to man the crosser now, but I can still throw this post over the mid read. So watch this. All right, well, I got absolutely shitted. <laughs> this game is hilarious. It's fine. I'll just rerun it the same way. So now we're baseline pressed here, shaded down, and I'm reclouding. But this is shaded down. So watch what the mid read does. It's going to follow the drag for a second, and it's going to let you get this post over the top of it. So you see that little window right there? All I did was pass lead to straight up, and it's a, it's a nice little pocket. So next, I'm going to show you guys against, um, sorry, I'm a little nasty. I'm getting over an illness, guys. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to get over, uh, I'm going to show you guys what you can throw against the cloud flash. So you can throw this drag now. Um, this is with no shading. I'm just going to show you guys with the drag. Do it a little bit earlier than you want to. I gained a few, but you want to let that bird hook go back first. So that, that don't do that. Wait a second longer. Watch. I'm gonna wait a second longer here, and it's gonna be better. Okay, you're gonna see it's covered too with clouds. Now watch. Uh, let the bird hook. Let the bird hook go back from the drag for a second. There you go. That's the timing you want. Uh, I'm gonna show you the replay, the little timing that you want uh, to let that bird hook go away. And you can see it, you can start throwing it the second you see him going back. So he's on a bird hook. He goes down to the drag. Right there, that's when you throw it. You see him put that foot in the ground and go backwards. That's when you let it go. And you see I'm, I'm releasing it right there. And then you get seven, eight yards. And now with the fall, the fall forward animation that you get nowadays, uh, post patch, you're going to be getting 12 to 15 on that. Now, let's work the, the rest of this play. So... I showed you guys the cross is going to get over reverse clouds. Um, I'm going to make sure the mid read doesn't man up here just so you can see it. But the cross is going to get over clouds every time. Yeah, I got shedded. That, that was just bad pocket. I rolled out there for no reason. Um, that's my fault. Um, baseline press here. 
and I'm shading down, but I'm putting clouds. Um, I'm shading back up. Just I don't want you guys to think that it's only because of shade down that he gets over, because he definitely gets over. But um, oh my goodness gracious, I just found a freaking nano. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I don't know. I don't know what to do here, boys. I'm not gonna hold you. Can't throw this crosser. I'm just gonna hang tight in the pocket. But you guys are gonna see it's gonna get over. Just want you guys to see it. There you go. And just pass lead it. Good to go. Right? So it gets over clouds. Now, you might think, okay, well, what if they baseline press deep quarter? So, you do this. See if he gets over that. And I'll even put a cloud flat for you. So you have a cloud, a deep quarter, all that. Right? Reblock here. You're going to see this cross is going to get over. Oh my gosh. I know, guys. I know. Don't say it. I don't want you to be that guy. Don't be the guy in the chat who says, oh, you'll never get that pass off. Well, guess what? That's why we have the drag. That's why we have the backside post. But, like, dang, man. They also don't shed like this. They really don't. Freaking practice mode is unreal. But you really, you really do have time to throw this. You really do. Um, but I guess not when it's trying to cheat you. But right there, look, that's perfect. I'm gonna go to the replay. That was that was good. I had to throw it even a little bit earlier than I wanted to, and it still got over. So we have a cloud here. I have a cloud flat, an outside deep quarter, and look, the crosser still gets over both of them, right in that pocket. And I had to throw it a little bit earlier. I'd rather throw it right here. And let him catch it right here on the sideline. But I had to catch it a little early. Still worked perfectly fine. So you guys see, it's going to beat everything. Um, I'll even show you it one more time. So you have that. You have that. You have a cloud flat. So there you go. You got everything here. Give me some time, boys. And perfect. That's that's ideally like the perfect spot. So you guys see how good it is. They're starting to give me some time in the pocket as well. Um, now I'll show you guys cover three now. So it's cover three. They're gonna deep quarter. If they don't, it doesn't really matter if they deep quarter or not. If they if, like because the deep third is just gonna match up to the post and the post is gonna beat man, so it'll beat it. Whatever. So if they're in hard flats, like. I showed you guys before. If they shade down, which is what I did right there, the hook curl comes down, <clears throat> and you just throw the post. Real easy, real simple. Um, now, if they shade up, which I will show you guys a replay for, because you guys need to see it, then you can just throw the drag, and you always have the crosser. No matter what, I showed you guys already, the crosser beats literally everything. So, even man, so it doesn't even matter. But if they shade up, you just hit the drag. And then you can still hit this post. So I'm going to show you on the replay that you can still hit this post. I don't know if I threw it too early or not. but So if they shade down, the hook curl just comes straight down to the drag. If they shade up, he plays the crosser for a second, and he's going to he's gonna move back to this post. So I didn't wait long enough, but he moves back to the post. So I'll show you guys that now. But you can still throw this post. You try to pass it in the right, right little spot. So... Go to cover three here. Shade it up still. We have cloud flats and we're shaded up or all that. And I'm gonna throw this post still. Just right in that little pocket. Um so this play is very, very good. This post gets open against everything. Um the crosser gets open against everything. I'm just gonna show you guys one more setup here. So if they do this, say they middle deep blue this guy, this post is still gonna get underneath it, so. So you have a post and a crosser that pretty much beat everything, and they're going to beat man most of the time too, so that's why it's so good. So you see it gets underneath the post. So very, very good play. You have quick reads with the drag and the post, and you have late reads with the crosser. And You actually, you can throw the crosser early too if they blitz, so I'm going to show you guys blitzing now. Um, it's very, 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 very good. Um, I always show you guys blitzes, and I always show you guys coverage just so you guys know it works against everything. Okay, so if they press here... <clears throat> so they're blitzing, right? 
you, I'm gonna man up the drag. So I'm gonna show you guys the different things that get open. I'm gonna try to stay alive in the pocket too for a second, just so you guys can see it. Throw, throw. I got it all day. So um, now I'm gonna show you guys in the replay is what I had to throw. So imagine this user's the guy that I manned up, right? This user's got to pick something. He picks the drag. You throw this crosser right here. Bam. Throw it right across the middle of the field. Right there. Post. You throw it right there. You have both. And then you have late reads, post, drag. So, like, you can throw them at any time. All right? <clears throat> now, I'm going to imagine the... Uh, sorry about that. I'm going to imagine the... Um, guy manned up on the crosser. Actually, I want to show you guys the crosser first. So, I'm going to man up the drag again. I'm going to throw the crosser in the middle of the field now. Just to throw you, just show you guys you can do it. Just gotta show you guys you can do it. That's it. And then after that, I'll man up the, the crosser and I'll throw the drag and then I'll throw the pole. Just kinda show you guys everything. So if he does that, bam. He picks the drag, you throw the crosser. Real simple, real easy. Um, now if he mans, if he takes the crosser, which I honestly would imagine is probably what he's gonna do most of the time, you, you can just throw the drag. like. It's not it's it's not the most complicated thing in the world, guys. Real simple. If they play hard flats, so um motion this guy over real quick. So say they play hard flats, right? Blitzing, blitzing, and then man up the crosser, right? So they so they're taking away the crosser and say you miss the drag late, like the drag gets to the hard flat and you can't throw it. They play hard flats, you throw that post really quickly. Now the cloud will follow it for a second. So let me show you on the replay what the hard flat does. So if they have a hard flat out there. I don't know what just happened. <laughs> um, you can instantly throw that. So he doesn't follow the post at all. If he's a hard flat, he literally just leaves the post. As soon as he breaks, you throw it. Now, if they play cloud flats, which I'm going to show you now. He follows it for a second. And you can see that, and that's how you know to take your drag. So he takes away the crosser with his user. And I'm gonna show you on the replay now that he kind of follows it for just a, like a second. Like he's not gonna follow it very long. You can still, like the post is still a good read against the, against the blitz if they, if they like, if they're not using it. But he, you can see he follows it for like a second, like one second. Now you can throw it, but like, you can see he follows it for a little longer than the hard flat does. Just something to see, that's something you guys can notice. Um, now I'm just going to show you guys one time against cover three. I mean, it's the same thing, essentially, like, <clears throat> so they blitz here, they blitz here, they have one user, really, I mean, you're going to have the post, you're going to have the drag on the back side, um, I'm just going to try not to get sacked here, and just try to show you guys every read in one replay, and then we can get out, and get out this video. There you go. All right. Perfect. Now I can show you all the reads. So they have one user. He's here. He takes the drag. Bam. I'm throwing this post right here. He takes the drag. I'm throwing this post back here. Now he doesn't have a flat back there. So you can instantly throw this. If you see he has no flat, I'm throwing this post right here. Bam. If he has no flat, you can throw it instantly. Um, if he didn't take the drag, say he took away the post, like the crosser in the post. You take the drag like it's just it's simple guys if it's coverage everything is going to get open if it's blitzing everything is getting open this mini scheme is very 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 good hope you guys enjoyed make sure you guys check the description for my ebooks take it easy peace